Today's review is on the crossover spinoff of Total Drama in 16. Also the second spinoff of Total Drama after Redunculus Race, Total Drama Rama. In the show we have Chef. Thank goodness there is no Chris since he is such a jerk. Also only caring about himself. Me this, me that. Screw you Chris. There's also Owen, Izzy, Noah, Harold, Beth. Bridget, Courtney, Duncan, Gwen, Lashana, Cody, MacArthur from the Redunculus Race series is on the show. And this is before her days as police cadet with her partner Sanders. Lastly, Jude of 16 is also on the show. I know when you guys saw the promo for Toad Drama Rama, you may have mistaken Jude as Ezekiel due to the hat, eyes, and hair. But Ezekiel has gray eyes, not blue like Jude's. He's a brunette, not a blonde. And him and Jude's hats are totally different. I'm sure you were asking yourselves, why is Jude on this show? Well, remember, this is a crossover spinoff since both creators of this show are the same creators of Toll Drama and 16. I mean, they both have the exact same Flash animation. So it makes sense why Jude is on the show, though he was never on Total Drama. I never saw Nikki again. I guess your family moved away. You also obviously noticed that Izzy has freckles on her face, since the original Izzy never had freckles on her face to begin with. Owen also has freckles on the show as a kid, since the original older Owen never had freckles in the first place. So what, Owen just had freckles as a kid, and then when he grew up, he just, the freckles just disappeared like that? Does that? How does that work? Is, is that possible? Did the freckles just fall off his face? Also, Lashana doesn't even have uh, the beauty mark on her right cheek like she originally does in Toll Drama. You're not going to see that beauty mark on her right cheek on the Toll Drama Rama series. And Gwen, in this show, has pigtails. So does Courtney. The characters are pretty much still the same from the original series, except for Duncan and Gwen. Uh, Duncan is still the bad boy juvenile delinquent when trying to escape from daycare. That is something the original Duncan would do. Duncan also sounds and looks like a character from Johnny Tess. Ironically, since both Toll Drama and Johnny Tess also have the exact Flash animation and also are a part of Teletoon. He really doesn't mess with or pick on the characters in this show, like Harold and Cody, which is fine since I didn't like him picking on Harold and Cody. At least Harold and Cody got revenge by Harold throwing water in his face, then punching Duncan in Toll Drama in Toll Drama Action, then Cody punching Duncan in Toll Drama World Tour. I rooted for them and I was pumped when they both punched Duncan. It was a wonderful moment for those two. Don't let their scrawny appearances fool you on the outside. Just because they look all scrawny on the outside doesn't mean they don't have any toughness of knocking the hell out of you on the inside. Now, what's up with Gwen? I know she's goth, but it's like she's been turned into a stereotypical goth spending time in the darkness. Like she's some gothic vampire. Last year alone, there were 43 crane-related deaths. Gwen, that might be a statistic about real cranes. The article just said cranes. Once she went into the darkness, I was like, oh, hell no. What have they done to Gwen? Especially when Owen was all uncomfortable. I mean, she made the others uncomfortable once again after she said something about, oh, they were going to die and it was going to lead to their deaths and saying bye. And then she disappeared back into the darkness. Then Izzy saying, bye, Gwen. I could see the original Izzy saying something like that. Bye is right. What the hell did they do to Gwen? I mean, she seems downright scary and uncomfortable to even watch or even be around. Like, I don't like what they've done to Gwen. Are you pleased with the way they turned Gwen in this show? Because I, I don't. I, 
She, uh, uh she made me feel uncomfortable. Get away from her. Do something about Gwen. Ah! I also don't care for the theme song. It sounds like a mixture of circus music and the Total Drama theme song put together for the sake of a daycare and one big old blender. The whole da 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 da. And then when you hear like the guitar playing, it makes you think of the Total Drama theme song part. I wanna be. I want to be, I want to be famous. I can see air from Ed and Nettie. Uh, singing to this Toll Drama Rama theme song. Da, 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 da. Come on, guys, sing to the theme song. <laughs> this theme song is awesome, guys. Da, 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 da. <laughs> so far, I'm cool with the Toll Drama Rama series so far. Because at first, I just wasn't sure about it. I was really hoping that they was going to come back for a new season. With all the told drama characters back in their original forms where they come back to compete. But they decided to go a different route and do this show. It was okay. You can say it's better than Teen Titans Go. I'm fine with this show. I can actually tolerate it. Alright, tell me your thoughts later.